What's up everyone? It's me. Same painting, same basement, different day, and today I'm here with a different snare comparison. So today we're going to be digging into two more metal snares that I have laying around here in the shop slash my basement slash my collection. Um, so they're going to both be 14 by six and a half. And uh, I'm going to do another vid short video real quick to run you through some more specs. Okay, so here are the two lovely snares we will be demoing uh, today. Again, I'll recap what they are. This is a Yamaha Stage Custom Steel Shell Snare. As you can see, it has a hole right here. It also has another big hole in there. I don't think those come from the factory like that. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, it's also been painted in powder blue very rough uh, a previous owner did it before i bought it i i still like it i think it gives the drum a lot of character but uh today it's featuring an evan snare side head with a 30 strand pure sound which is usually more than i would put on and uh we also have an evans uv2 on top like basically new this is this is a really cool drum uh, the second drum we'll be looking at is a Ludwig Superphonic. This was actually converted from a super sensitive, so as you can see, it has some extra holes. Um, it came without a badge, so I'm not exactly sure what era it's from. I want to say it's like 80s or 90s, but I I'm not really sure. Um, this was also painted kind of poorly uh, in in black paint and uh it kind of looks like a black beauty I'll, I'll call it a poor man's black beauty so again these are both 14 by six and a half uh the ludwig has ludwig snares on it remos ambassador snare side head and an old ludwig heavy head on top i'm looking forward for you uh you guys to hear these drums so uh i'll be back with some videos Again, I'm going to do it blind style, uh, drum one and drum two. All right, see you on the other side. Hope you enjoyed those videos everybody who's your winner please let me know in the comments uh i will let you know mine at the end uh but uh i really tried to be a little bit more particular about how i did these videos this time i tried to be more consistent in terms of grooves and uh what i played and how loud i'm playing the snares um, given this is you know i'm still learning so there's a lot of you know rough audio but i don't add any effects 
onto uh, these videos, what you're hearing is just two mics, one overhead, a uh, large diaphragm condenser, and then a crotch mic that's like some old Shure SM57 type. Uh, I, that's how I really want to do things, uh, on this channel. I just want it to be kind of bare bones, just be like your average, uh, Joe drummer, because this is after all a working man's drum shop. So, uh, that being said, uh, drum roll, please. Uh, I will reveal which one. Was which. So, uh, snare number one was actually the Ludwig Superphonic, uh, and snare two was the Yamaha steel shell snare. Now, if you were to ask me, um, I will tell you my winner. I'm first going to tell you wh what I liked about each drum. Now, I feel like the Ludwig Superphonic had a really nice bite to it. It has a lot of exotic character. Um, it, it just like, it, it's not super clean it's kind of grungy kind of grimy um obviously you know everybody relates to superphonic especially the 14 by six and a half to john bonham it definitely has that kind of sound um now the yamaha i thought was just really really nice and clean sounding uh it, it just like was right in the middle of the mix uh it could fit into any situation so in my mind, the winner of this snare comparison today was the Yamaha Steel Shell. Now, if you ask me in a month, my opinion might change, but I really like the way that Yamaha sounds, and I'm going to be playing it on some of my gigs in the future. Uh, so if you like this video, please leave a comment. If you have an opinion about which one you think is better, uh, please leave that comment as well. If you think I'm dead wrong and you want to tell me off, do that as well. Again, I'm Stephen Perry from Steve's Drum Shop Philly, and I will see you all soon. Hope you enjoy some bonus footage. Bye.